Hello everyone, Delightful here. I like the novel and the new, so today, let's see what the indie world has for me and you. Today, as you can see here, we have Spell Rain. A fun title screen, looks nice. This, it's charming music, I feel like I've heard it somewhere before. It feels influenced by something. Almost, It's almost Final Fantasy-like, which I like, it's nice. Is it this, <laughs> Spell Rain here, focusing, is, well, very cutesy, isn't it? I mean, I'm not super into being a pretty little girl. I mean, that's... Okay, that, that's nice. It's an optional kitty. Got that kitty. But, I like, you know, maybe we, like, she, she looks like a little child, right? That's not, that's not my vibe. Like, maybe if I get, like, I don't have like, another option, I can get, like, an angry-looking halfling with a goatee or something. That'd be cool. Cause you, maybe she's a halfling, right? Maybe she's just short. Anyway, this is an action... Well, a bullet hell. Top down shooter. Horde survival, wave survival, whatever you want to call it. But I actually aim. Unlike vampire survivors, I'm actually aiming. And in vampire survivors, all you do is you move and you play in your build. That, that's it. Ma mainly figure eights. And mana progression. That, that's. Yeah. It's power fantasy. Whereas this one requires a bit more attention. I'm, I'm aiming, I'm shooting. Now, you'll notice I'm not my speed. I can hold down if I want. My speed is not decreasing when I'm moving. No, that's something I look for. But in this. I can't just shoot willy-nilly, right? The cost drains my mana, right? I'm a wizard. I'm a mage, young wizard. So and a big part of the meta progression, I believe, in this game is going to be unlocking outfits. Uh, a shop has appeared, yeah. So there's a shop in there, a better wizard, who sells spells to you. And the meta currency... Well, the meta currency is coins, but what the wizard wants is the crystals. He wants, he's using me as some kind of child labor to acquire crystals for him because he's a coward. Pretty much. And the child doesn't know any better. <laughs> yeah. Capitalist wizard, what they do, right? Exploiting the young for fun and profit. I should go in there, really. Oh, yeah. HP will drop. And other stuff will disappear, right? So there's that. That would get frustrating if it did disappear. I can just... I can go in there and still stuff still going to be around. Finish this little group here. <laughs> Keep the... I mean, I'm not super into the cute art style, but those monsters, those, those are charming cute slimes, they really are, and the bats, all the monsters are cute. I mean, she, even the main character, she, she's a cute little girl, it's just, it's not my vibe, right? I want an angry halfling <laughs> with furry feet and a goatee, <laughs> who's angry about being short. Right, this is the wizard, can't shoot him. Random abilities to purchase, right? Now I can get a card, like, the level ups in this, you notice I didn't level, right? I was collecting... The within run currency, the the crystals, right? But I'm not getting like a pop up level. No, my level ups come from finding the wizard and then buying one of however, however many of these I want or afford. And I can reroll. Teleport, not super enthused with. I can also heal over here for crystals as well. I like fireball. Yep, slot it in, and I can actually slot it in. First, I was like, how do I move things? Well, I click tab, and then I click and drag. I'm actually cool. Like a fireball is good damage, but it's fire typed. Their enemies have resistances in this, yeah. So the, the fire slimes you'll see, they're resistant to fire. They're a green slime. They're sorry, yeah, they're a green slime, but they're also blue ones, and they are resistant to guess what? Ice. So you want a variety of spells, and the spells do feel different beyond just you know, they're weak to this, they're weak to that. Ugh, the dash. It's one of the critiques I have about the game that you should get that by default. It feels really, really off not having a dash because my movement speed's super slow. I mean, they're, they're a little child with little legs. That's why, <laughs> but still. Now I have a dash, which I should probably have started with. Because when you first start, you got nothing, right? And then you do a little tutorial, and they give you this. You should, they, they give you this, right? So you should start with, when you start a game, this, the magic missile, the magic bolt, which I actually call, the one thing I didn't call it, magic shot, all right? Magic arrow, whatever you want to call it, and a dash. Now, you see those hit points there? Don't pick those up. Because I don't need them. I'm not going to go over. I'm not going to get any benefit picking them up now. So if I can remember they're there, I can just treat the inventory, tre treat the the battlefield as my own private inventory. Because then I'll give me an inventory for collecting potions. So I'll just leave it on the ground and hoover it up when I need it. Oh, I should have fireball. Use it. So your fireball deals more damage, but it's slower. See, it feels different. Magic missiles quick and fast, or magic smack shot, whatever they're calling it. <laughs> Such a there's, I'm not into the cutesy art style, I swear, but those are very amusing, very, very amusing slimes. Uh, see, a door to the shop has opened. Now, when you see that, you should probably go get it. It's not going to disappear on you. I kind of wish it would. Well, that'd be interesting. Because they'll get you to hustle over there. See, they, they wisp there. That Ultima 7 style wisp, it's telling me the, the shop is to my northwest. What is that? North-northwest. 
sorry. See those, those blue slimes there? They're resistant to cold. But they take full damage from... Oh, see. Oh, he lit on fire. He takes extra damage. He takes extra damage from the fire because he has ice, right? So pick up... They can also smash those those crystals and get more currency. And the the terrain here does have collision. Like most of it does. Not those little pedestals for whatever reason. I don't know. It's super early demo. I'm not going to critique it too hard, but... See, This is always moving, so don't think it's always going to be here. Follow the wisp. Oh, I want that. Sometimes you can find cards out in the open and so you could think like well, come on don't be like that don't be like that so if i pick up that card and say it's magic missile or fireball or whatever that'll just level up the spell slot so that's how you get stronger in this game you're a wizard everything is about your spells everything else everything else whether it's hit points or movement speed whatever is secondary and a distant secondary at best what do you offer me fireballs fireball level two see it's going much faster now i can also go into this and pause if i need to so fireballs now i see tier two and it shoots a fireball that explodes on impact! Exclamation point. Ooh, it's almost- wow. It deals a lot more damage, has a minor AoE, and travels faster than Magic Shot. But if I upgrade Magic Sh Though, even if Magic Shot's like 100% inferior, well, it still deals more damage versus the frost creatures. And I'm gonna start encountering fire monsters who are resistant to fire. So, both spells are worthwhile. It's also lightning you can find that's really cool. I'll show that. Got some materials you can get as well. I believe that's for customizing outfits. Got some spells for you. We'll see. What do you have? Teleport and uh, ice shotgun's quite nice. Hmm. Now this is left mouse button, right mouse button, space, and shift. I don't know if the dev at some point plans to have key... Um, obviously this keyboard support. But have rebindable keys. It's super early. Or I'm planning. I'm seeing they do because it's great out. They're planning to do it as well as gamepad support. The gamepad wasn't currently working for me. I could move around, but I couldn't attack, so that's not not doable. I'm sure it's planned. It's a bullet hell, right? <gasps> the lightning is here. Hmm. I can. Oh yeah, there we go. Five more damage. Yeah. It's a no brainer. I already have it. Hmm. I shotgun a lightning bolt. Does anyone have a preference? I and mean, both are good, but the lightning bolts. Oh man, so good. I need it. It's like the thumb of God, you'll see. Because it's coming down from the sky, right? I can just... Yeah, it's very handy. Mm -hmm. Now, where do I want it? Instantly creates lightning where you're pointing at. It's very, very potent. I guess I'll keep it on shift. That's what shift is. Boop. Cute sound effect. <laughs> yeah. It's very precise. Like, sometimes you'll fight monsters, and they have, like, little bodyguards that dance around them trying to take shots for them. And so the lightning bolt come from the sky is pretty good at not just hitting them, but also hitting the guys around them. <laughs> it's expensive. It's not the most efficient use of my... Like the bats, they drop in one shot, right? So you want to handle them efficiently with the magic missile. The fireball, that's what you want to use on the frosty guys, right? Or is it it's one mana inefficient to use it on the... You should get those crystals. Actually, the most efficient way to get XP in this. The bats are actually the major threat until the ranged enemies start coming because they're fast. Shop already, huh? I'm noticing the shots, the shops tend to come pretty much whenever you get a level up in like a vampire starter like. Because that's what they are. Oh, this is trash. Well, I hit them anyway. No matter. You're right. Oh, I have to be very careful because I have one resource. Well, hit points and my offensive resource is, well, it's mana. So my dash costs mana. <laughs> I don't have like a timer on that. I can dash as much as I want, but I don't have to pay for it, right? Ow. Bomb damage, you see. What do you offer me? Teleport? Mm. Frostmine is quite tempting. I have room for it. Dash on shorter cooldown. Okay, I prefer it costs less instead, but alright. And I can spend... Uh, I only took one hit. Okay. Hmm. So it teleports me. Nicely, the game teleports me into a different place. So if I go into the shop surrounded by enemies, I won't get instantly annihilated. Or if I don't dash quick enough. If I fireball twice, is that... Yeah, here we go. So this guy, say, eight. He takes... Or is... I get the the damage effect there. It's higher. So what is it? Like, 18. What is it for? Okay, they seem to have a generic weakness to fire. The slimes. Hmm. But not the fire ones, obviously. See, lightning bolt's quite pricey. Fireball is what I should use unless I really need the lightning. The shop has opened. 
Yeah, but I know each thing costs at least 50, and well, 50 for a level 1, but I don't need any more level 1, so I'm probably paying some type of 100. See, not the thing to do versus those guys, the fire. But he's having knockback too. <laughs> Pile of goodies. Now, the goal is the meta currency. That unlocks the more spells you can get. They have, you have a chance of finding, right? Ouch. Like the lightning bolt. Well, the lightning bolt I can find, but the ice mine. There's an ice lance. No mana, really? The lightning bolt's what I should be using. I have to level that. My DPS is falling behind. Ah, the, the, the little baby dragons of familiars are starting to appear. Mm. Mm. And lightning bolt gets really good. Scales up a bit. Hmm. Look who's back. Ice shard, no. Mm. It gets a lot cheaper. Yeah, that's really good. Minus four, <laughs> minus four mana cost. And you're right. Ten. That was expensive, but it was worth it. Sorry. I didn't get any DPS increase though, so. Mm. Yeah, and the, and the the flame drakes, because they shoot fire, uh, are fire creatures, so they take less damage from fire, right? 15, 15, 6, they take like half, so they have damage resistance. Hmm, need more crystals. It's not even enough for one upgrade. Ooh. And after a certain period of time, once it's... So no, this isn't my XP bar or anything, because XP is directly tied to my... My spells, right? My, my character level goes up and I become more powerful. But that that's when the boss appears. He's coming. Regardless if you're ready or not. I, I wonder. I probably should take an ice ability to handle those guys a bit more efficiently. Thank you for the hit points. I've noticed every time you go in the shop, the ice crystals will... Well, the, the crystals tend to respawn. Ah, that's the highest tier monsters. The <laughs> angry pineapples. Angry unripe pineapple, maybe. Maybe two upgrades? Lightning, please. Magic shot three, I'll take it. And if I do a rune of lightning, thank you. If I do the reroll, that doesn't actually populate two more. It populates, it just swaps these two. So I can't get in here and just, I mean, eh. I can't get in here and just get a full sweep. I mean, I, I think it'd be okay if that happened. Just get four new abilities, because I wouldn't be able to afford them. Likely. Alright, so the boss is coming soon. And they are, no, they are getting stronger as the waves go because this is a vampire starter like, right? The enemies get stronger as you go, and this gives you incentive to become stronger yourself. Well, I suppose they could just have the monsters not get stronger, just have more of them. I mean, this is pixely, so it shouldn't start hitting frame rate. Maybe eventually it would. I mean, just scaling up monsters is the easier way to do it, I guess. I'd like to see them, some, maybe, ah, okay, no, no, no. The monsters maybe stay the same. See, lightning's quite effective. But it's expensive. Oh, it's only six now. It's better than it was like 13 before. Ice shards would be very handy here. Range enemies being the big threat they are. I really should have taken ice to handle these guys. No matter. You're right. You kind of cool if you could pick up the potion. Uh oh. Out of time. This guy, the Oak Sovereign. He's really fun, Moss. You'll see why. He summons buddies, right? And he, he's remember this bump damage. So he sends, he summons spikes. So he, this boss is cool. He's slow, but he, ow, it, he hurts when he hits you. You have to pay attention. I was like, ooh, gems. And I was actually, this is, this is the guy with the bodyguards. So to be very careful. Ow. That wasn't careful. That was that was sloppy. <laughs> I handled this guy like twice easily earlier. <laughs> yeah. My feel's not doing so great right now. Oh, oh! I didn't even see it was under my feet. Ah! Oh, it's annoying. I wasn't doing so great that time. Let's see if I unlocked anything. This gives me a chance to shut the minute progression. So there's this guy here who's supposed to be all about the outfits, but he's not currently working. I don't know, super early demo. 
Oh, there it is. I just wasn't clicking it. Irritating. I just saw this. I'm like, is it working? I can get a hat. And it gives me mana? Done. <laughs> okay, that's cute. Alright, that's, that's super cute. Okay. What kind of gear are you looking for? Oh, so this is the meta progression. My outfit. Hit points. All done. Now I have like a Zelda outfit. And I can get a book. Apprentice book. It gives me more mana. I, I have the book at my side, I guess. Look at that. There's a bit of mana progression I wasn't even looking at. Apprentice wand. I was really only... I could have... That's funny. I could have made this stuff right at the start, but I didn't. <laughs> oh, it's... Oh, oh, that's cute. Okay, I'm not into the cutesy stuff, but that's cute. So, I can actually... Oh, my God. So, yeah, roguelite in, in the meta progression is quite vital. I, ooh. Invulnerability. Increases the period of invulnerability of being taken damage. Oh, so it improves the iframes. All right. So it look like here. Green. Oh, okay. So the different outfits have different bonuses. This is the invulnerable, invulnerable set, I guess. Huh. This gives me 10, 15. This, oh, this gives me hit points. This gives me MP. Wait. Lifestyle. <laughs> lifestyle chance. Lifesteal chance. Each piece increases the lifesteal amount. Oh my. Wield thine axe. <gasps> Vampire, I love it. Oh wow, that she's 100% she's goth girl now. Oh, that's kind of funny. Attacks. This, that's the basic set. I mean, I don't know why you picked that. I guess when you first start. This gives me hip attack. Mana, hit points, and hit points. This is all attack, mana, and life steal. This grants me attack, mana. Enemies drop more money, so it's like a grinding set. A full set, I have a dragon familiar fight alongside me. Wow. And the death. Oh my god. Full set. Oh, it's set bonuses. Chance for cooldown to reset when defeating an enemy. What cooldown? <laughs> okay. All right, so emo goth girls heading in. It's actually kind of funny. Oh my god, my stats are gigantic now. <laughs> Jesus, look at that. Well, I become massively stronger already just by. Yeah, that's a big part of the meta progression there. The outfits. So that's interesting. The meta progression isn't just the coins; it's the the bits. I had a lot of bits actually, just testing things repeatedly. Well, I've become massive. Sloppy. Well, I did that on purpose, so I can test my life drain, and life drain's massive. Jesus. Wow. Okay. I don't see how the tree's gonna have to stand a chance now. Hmm. Door to the shop is open. Jesus, I can just hold it down. I saw something there. I got a little XP up. I was going to see if I was, like, leveling up the spell. I don't think so. I mean, I really don't need any... Well, eventually I'll need the DPS upgrades for the spell, but that's about it. I think I'll need a dash. Well, that's what I might. I'll just get the dash, yeah. I want at least 100 before I go in there. Yeah, at first I wasn't really enthused with this game because I saw that it wasn't affecting your movement speed when you when you fire, but because there's now the mana limitation, that changes everything. Because you have a meaningful choice in terms of whether you fire or not. And even with bump damage, yeah, it's okay. There we go. It's more than I needed. So this is a very survivable build. I don't think I need that much survivability. I probably just focus on more mana. Even though I do have disgusting amounts compared to what I had before. Should be three upgrades. 
I got something new for you. See those statues? You can interact with them to enhance your gear. Oh, because I put on outfits. Doing so will level up your gear, which increases its stats. This number here tells you how many times you can use them. Each time you enter my shop, I will add one point as a treat. The effect will wear off by the time you go back to your base, though. Yeah, that's the, other, that's the other main critique I have about the game. Is that you can unlock spells and stuff. Even if you, can, even if you clear the zone, you set the next zone with nothing. I'd say you should keep the stuff you've earned up to you. Well, until you die, right? So I guess I can pick one. More mana, more damage. Gear upgraded. That's cool. That's interesting. I hadn't noticed that before what, because I wasn't putting on outfits. Do you have the dash for me? Frost mine. Tempting. Magic shot upgrade. Yes. I shot. I shot. Eh, we'll go ice shotgun. Okay, I guess I can't afford anything else. But a shotgun's really good. Do, do, do. Not versus him. Because he's ice. <laughs> but versus you. It's a shotgun. <laughs> it's very effective. Has a little cooldown to it. <laughs> Not versus you. Ew, coffee. Those hit point things I've noticed, they tend to heal about... What is it, about 10? Pretty generous. Door to the shop is open. Alright. So slime bits I was using to upgrade things. Oh, actually ran out of mana. Wow. Yeah, it's the best way to get the, the crystals, actually. Go and get the crystal formations. Hey! My own fault. I would like to see procedural generation on the maps. I mean, this one doesn't have it. That would make the areas feel a bit more fresh. I mean, yeah, the, the wizards... Shop's always in a different location on the map, but the map's always, it feels, they feel very similar. They always feel about the same. Lightning? I guess it's gonna be a lightning build then. I don't know if I want lightning instead of a dash on spacebar. Probably not. Mana. Yeah, I need more mana regen, actually, not the health regen. Oof. I have a dash for me. A fireball. No, we did that last time. Frostbind's tempting. Magic shot three. I mean, obviously. You're not giving me the dash. Alright, what else you have for me? Ice shards, frost mines, kind of funny. It costs 10 though. Lightning up. We'll take that. Dash, thank you. No, we, we don't want. We want. There we go, thank you. Dash on spacebar. Alright. Oh, that's so much mana. Love it. Three tap those guys. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know how I die this time. I don't think so. I don't think I'm going to. Door to a shop, really? I think I might actually want that as a secondary. Yeah, I think I do. It's just so much more effective. Like, it's, it's more effective when I get them clustered up like that. 
mask because the lightning bolt hit like three of them. Big pile of goodies over there. Oh, I yeah, shot the wizard a bit. He's down there. They're getting pretty tanky now. Oh, I missed my upgrade last time. Doesn't matter. I can just get it again, right? What's that? An orb? Bat wings. More mana. Bat robes. Hit points. Uh, I've upgraded the hat to the max, huh? More mana. More hit points. <laughs> and you have lightning at three. Yeah, plus 25 damage. Disgusting. Love it. Dash. A dash at two only decreases the cooldown by 1.5. I don't dash that much because I prefer to use my mana for DPS because I have one resource. I'm not cutting health. <laughs> it's silly looking slime. I love it. It's a charming looking game. It really is. So they're not grimdark, right? Well, you never know. Like, what are these slimes' intentions towards this young girl, right? They're probably not. They're probably not good. They're bad dudes, right? They're hungry. Like, ah! <laughs> First thing of the lightning bolt feels good. Go to shop again, really? I mean, I probably should get my fanny over there. Because I don't have to kill all the monsters, right? All the monsters bail when the big daddy shows up. Oh, I should have picked that up. Oh, the lightning feels so good. That's what I should be using like all the time now. It just disintegrates them. Oh, pile of crystals over there. Now it's just sloppy of me. I'm trying to rush a little bit. Trying to reserve the lightning till I can get them clustered up like that. So I can like six of them. That's just beautiful. That's how it's meant to be done. Until I crush the yeah the first time I beat him, I took him off lightning, and I beat him without upgrades. Ah, oh, there you go, right there. Lightning does have a little bit of a cooldown, but it's not much. Yeah, so the end is near. That guy's coming. Ouch. What do you have for me? You have dash? Mm, what else? Fireball? No. Frost mine? No. Ice shard? No. Dash. And replacing these three, what do you have? Magic shard? I cannot afford. Uh, unfortunate. It's fine. Not a big deal. I'm more than strong enough to handle them. I might get one more shot before the the Oaken Sovereign comes. I'm trying to think. Three, six, nine. Yeah, it's cheaper to use this to kill them. Unless I need the DPS per minute. You know, I'm using the magic missile and the lightning bolt, so I should focus on. Because it's so much level that. The same level. It's just. It, it starts off like super expensive and it gets super awesome. Hundred and seventy one, wild. I wonder if the plant guy's weak to it. Maybe. Oh, I do get another shot. It's down there, huh? Give me that gold piece. That's how you unlock new spells that can drop, like uh, this spell here, the ice shards, that's one that I had to ow, that one I unlocked. Mm, Frost mine's another. The Frost Lance is another. I'm not very impressed with that one. Oof, just got in. Boss about to show up. Magic Shot, yeah, I need that. And... I mean, I, I guess I'll take the four hit points. Because he's coming. He's dead, but he's coming. Oh, I could heal for free. The Oaken Sovereign.
Remember, don't move. And remember, I'm, I'm having to manage my... So my damage per second goes up when I use that. So these guys are going to start hedging me in. Ah, I didn't want to do that. That's fine. Can also dash through it. Uh-oh. Okay, got to chill now. You got to keep summoning people. Ah. See, they do hit hard. That's the thing. <laughs> ow, ow. Two hits. I wonder if he's getting stronger as I do. It'd be kind of cool. Ah. See how handy this is? Because if I fire to him, he will... Well, his bodyguards will tank it. He's done. Oof. Beautiful. Piles of goodies. Thank you. I do wish they'd all vacuum up, but they won't. See, that it's going to stage clear. I'm going to lose those. Annoying, but it's fine because I actually lose everything once I go to the next zone. Because it takes me right to the hub. I can't just go right to the next zone. So, unfortunate. Hello there. Need new gear? Sure. What do you have for me? I've killed enough dragons. I can actually get this stuff. Mm, mana hat? Sure. Go all fiery. I'm a full set. Go Pyromancer. Not my color. But. I mean, bones. I haven't encountered the skeletons yet. Skull clothes. Pretty cool. Let's show off these spell unlocks as well. Hello. Do you want to help me with my research? No, you help me. So this is how you get spells. You don't choose. You get a booster pack and you get one of these. Black hole. Electric spear. Great fireball. Or Azura Arrow. Inferno, Electro Bolt. What do you have for me? Inferno! Cool. Ignites an area and burns enemies who entered. I wonder if it burns me too. That'd be fun. And what do we got? Azure Arrow. So, shoots a magic arrow that speeds up and pierces all enemies. So, Arcane Arrow. That's nice. Electro Bolt. Electric Bolt. Shoots a bolt of electricity that jumps to nearby enemies after hitting them. Ooh, it chains. Nice. What do you have here? Slow Starters gets me... Black hole. Creates a black hole that attracts enemies to it and crushes them in the singularity. Well, one can hope. So pretty fun. Let's see. Let's see how fiery is. Because I'm going to get pretty familiar with this one and see I'm going along. I'm guessing also you're going to be able to set the difficulty with day and night. Night might be where you need to find... Oh, yeah. Wow. Night might be where you find the undead and skeletons. Oh, my mana is nothing compared to where it was, though. Whoa. Interesting. Interesting. I think my DPS is higher. And definitely the familiar. I'm not really a summon build though. For the aesthetic of the goth girl, that's kind of kind of funny. I'll lock it all though, why not? Well, this is the best look before the default one. <laughs> Yeah, enemies do seem more aggressive on level 2. Coming in faster and hotter. Just as squishy, though. How much do you damage do you do? Oh, you do, you do more... No, you do a little bit less than I do. 15. It's enough to one-shot these bats, though, so... Pretty good. Well, at least 100. Oh, I have that. Our slimes are starting to appear. Like, I want to dash, right? Definitely want to dash. It just feels like something you should automatically have. See, each level feels about the same, though, layout-wise. It feels a bit different with the monster density, and they're, they're coming at me faster, but... It's the same type of monsters. Maybe it's because it's the demo and I'm just repeating the same day? I don't know, maybe. That could be it. I'm sure the full game will have more. Yeah, and the, the thing I can find there. Inferno, yeah, cool. So it has a long cooldown. Ignite an area and burn an enemy who enters it. Okay, so... Come on, come on. Oh. It's like Bonfire from 5th Edition D&D. I mean, it hits really hard, though. 
That's nice. It's like a burning oil pit. That's kind of cool. I don't think I'll keep that. It suits this this pyromancer. And it's burning so hot and so high it gets the bat too, like that. And the bat gets here, it triggers up and cooks it. Ow. That's my own fault. Being sloppy. That's pretty good. Hmm. You've been upgrading your gear, y'all. Well, attack. Mana. I want more mana. And you have magic shots. Inferno. Ten. It didn't go up, did it? Just deals four more damage. Okay. And frost mine. Now we're gonna fire this time. Black hole. <laughs> Black hole. My middle mouse button. Okay. That's probably a poor poor idea. Hmm. It. Is it just crowd control? Maybe. I don't know. Well, I think I should upgrade magic shot just to be safe. Hmm. Attracts enemies. I think it just attracts them. It's just crowd control. It, it's a nice combo with this, though. See? Pulls them into it and cooks them. That's a solid combo. Yeah. That works. Get both of those cheaper, and then all I'll need now is my dash. Yeah, my my DPS is actually really high because I'm just yeah the familiar is really helping. I mean yeah my my mana isn't as disgustingly high as the other guy, but the familiar just just doesn't stop firing. Just keeps keep it going. Sometimes every now and then, but it doesn't seem to be much of a lull in terms of when they fire and when they don't. It slows them down a bit. Oh, but this good this build to be very, very good with the bonfire and the the singularity. Just roping them and just pulling them into a big heap and then cooking them all. Like, I'm already getting a lot more, a lot more crystals than I had, even last run. That was a very strong last run, too. Not having the dash is concerning, though. I do need that. I bet you the little familiar guys deal more damage to the ice guys, and there are quite a few ice guys in this. Yeah, they are, see? <laughs> That's really nice. Ow. It's my own fault. <laughs> yeah. Beautiful. Pulling them into a crushing inferno. I don't think the singularity actually does damage. They just dance around the event horizon, I guess. They're too big to fit inside, maybe. No mana. Seven hundred fifty. <laughs> Jesus. All right. Tunic gets me more hit points. Speed. I just get faster. Okay. And you offer me what? What? I shard. No, thank you. Frost mine. No, thank you. Inferno level three. Yes, it becomes super cheap. And electro bolts. I mean, I, I gotta play around with it. Okay. I mean. Okay. What else do you have, buddy? I shotgun dash. Well, I need the dash. I need the dash. I can't not have that. That'd be silly. Electric bolts. The jumps. Has a little bit of a cooldown. Probably not a good primary. It's alright. I mean, if anything, it encourages discipline, right? Because you can't just hold it down. Oh, wow. It pierces. Ooh. Okay. Well, that's fun. It's really encouraging me to bank mana, isn't it? Ooh, I like that. 
I can just kind of hold it down. It doesn't hit that hard. Not at all. Hmm. The shop is opened. Yeah, I'll go find the shop again. Bad guy, guy. Kind of like the electro bolt. I don't like as much as the fireball, the, the, the inferno. That, that's incredible. This electro bolt needs to be higher damage though for me. Inferno level four. I, I can't say no to that. That's just disgusting. Black hole. Yeah, air effect stronger. Fireball. No, no, no. Electro bolt two. Yeah, I'll take that. And you offer me more hit points. You offer me more mana. Gear upgraded indeed. Getting stronger and stronger. Yes, I'm clearly at the mid progression point where this level's <laughs> far too easy for me. But I, this game's really all about the spells and how different they all feel. Like, this isn't just a recolored arcane bolt, right? And this bonfire ability is incredible. And Piggyback so well with the singularity ability I have here. And then I might not even... You don't even really have to take a dash. I guess you could just take a teleport instead. That's, I think, longer range, but has more of a cooldown. Do I have a shop again? Sure. If I just burn so that's hit me. Taking out the drakes anyway. And I can hold on fire going at once. Nice. That's just me getting cocky there. Uh <laughs> Hey, woo woo woo. I can forward wherever I want. Hmm. And more attack? Sure. And what do you have? Lightning? No, we already did lightning. Lightning's really good though. Fireball? No. Black hole? Sure. Now it costs six. Magic shot three? I'll take it. Because I might need it. Ice shotgun. I can roll again. No, I'm not going to because I can I'm pretty sure I'll get one more shop. Just to be quick to get it. <laughs> Seven. Seven and it's leaping somewhere else. No shop yet, huh? The magic missile hits harder and is higher level, but I worry that's going to drain me. Man, that's going to encourage me to drain me. I think I'll just try and stick with the electric bolt. And mana shop is magic shop is to the, the southeast over there. South southeast. My last upgrade gives me pile hit points. Very nice. And you have magic shot four. Ugh. I mean, I kind of need that. I'll take it. What else? Fireball, lightning, or electro bolt three. Okay. If I try it one more time. Because I know it's the boss coming up. I shotgun or teleport. Yeah, teleport instantly moves me to where I'm aiming, whereas dash moves me in the direction I'm facing. <coughs> Sorry. Maybe one of these times I will try to 
go teleport, not dash. See how that how that compares. Got fields of crystals. Love it. I'm gonna roast this guy. I wanna bet he's weak to fire. He's just a thought I have. I mean, he's actually not, I don't think, but... He's burning. I'm disintegrating him, yes. Yeah, I've already killed all his minions, so... Oh, he has a nice regeneration effect on him, too. Good job, buddy. I think he's immune to Singularity, though. He's too big. Ow. He's already dead? Yeah. I disintegrated him. That's, that's pretty funny. Fun game. I'm really started enjoying it much more once I discovered the outfits. I thought they were just stylistic choice, but no, no, it's, uh, it's a lot of power there. <laughs> Hello, kitty. Cool if you could take your kitty as a, as a familiar as well. I don't be like that tree. Thank you. Discovered new spell. Um. Well, if I click this, what happens? That that appears to be a bug. That appears to be a bug. Yeah, because it let me click it when there was nothing new to unlock. Hmm. Electric spear. Cool. And mega fireball. Right. Great fireball. She's a powerful but slow fireball. Explodes on impact. Anyway, this I think this game's off to a really good start. This is Spell Rain Demo. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. Bye.